armed forces, or is it an, a hat that he made for himself? That's the question, isn't that it? That is the question. It's hard to tell either way, but either way, I respect it. What if he's a government agent designed to get us to love join wobbling. the army? Oh, that too. <laughs> All of a sudden, I love wobbling. <laughs> All of a sudden, though. All of a sudden. All right, here we go. Looks like we're getting into it. All right, we're going to go. Yoshi's story to start. Yeah. Falcon Ices, uh, both unsponsored, it looks like. Yeah, at the moment. Yeah. Sponsor these men. Yeah. Oh, and then is dead. Yeah. Oh, and... Well, you're never really that scared here, right? Especially on Yoshi's. Mm -hmm. Oh, that was great. That was a solid uh, crouch cancel to try to grab the, the Falcon. Couldn't get it the second time. Yeah, it's harder for Ices because their dash isn't oh, as good. Okay. So he tried to wave dash after the crouch cancel to get the follow up, but yeah. not quite there. Man, Johnny's really good at this matchup. Just the yeah. way he splits them up, the way he does the pressure on shield. When he does get the hit, he goes for these huge hits, right? Like he goes for knee right away, goes for stomp right away. Yeah. That's what Just you should be doing in the matchup. Brutal. I mean, that's that's part of what makes this. That's pretty much all of what makes this a hard matchup for Ices, right? Is Falcon can keep the pressure so well, he can space everything on the shield. He can make it near impossible for Ices to land a solid hit in the neutral. Yeah. The crowd is on Army's side, though, if I'm hearing this correctly. Anytime he gets a hit, um, yeah, he gets some, a KO. Some woos. Some woos. Oh. oh. And, oh, S2J with a great smash DI to get out of that. Yeah. Oh, oh and he gets the wall. Let's go, Army. Woo! <laughs> Woo! A little side cam here. Woo! S2J thinking about... That's the, the. I think that's actually the worst part about wobbling is yeah. you just have to think about how you made a mistake and are now getting wobbled for it. It depends on your mentality, right? I right. feel like it could be good if you use that time constructively. Yeah. I got hit by this. Let me think. But about it's hard it. to do that, it's right? Because you're just sitting there getting infinite. Right. No, I agree. There's a. Ooh. Nice little bait there from Army. Gonna punish him. This is a hard edge guard to do on Falcon, just because Falcon is gonna live for so long. Mm -hmm. Yes. Ooh. Stop the knee. SVJ taking the lead back. Just waiting out the inv invincibility on the ledge. Johnny's playing it so well. When you go platform to platform like that, it's so hard for Icy's to really follow you, right? Yeah, there's not much they can do. Oh, and and look at oh, the cloud. Oh, the double save. But, but that's, yeah. that's the thing about saving Nana. Uh, if the opponent does it oh right, then God. Nana's usually dead anyway. And then sometimes Popo's in a worse spot. So. Right. It's a risk. Oh man, doing down smash is so smart because it's going to yeah. push even if it hits shield. Right. Just the move choices for Johnny are very oh. solid. And the shield drop knee going to end that game Yo, solidly. Wild. Even with the wobble. Yeah. Just a solid two stock from SDJ. Yeah, the strength of Army in stages like that is that he has a really good understanding when he does get on the platform. Mm -hmm. He gets a lot of raw grabs, right? right? That didn't quite happen because Johnny was so fast and he kept his mix-up game so heavy right. that you didn't see too many grabs from Army there. Yeah. Only one wobble. Yeah. We're going to go FD. The platforms are really what <laughs> made it hard, but even on a oh stage man. like this, he still he keeps it so simple. Yeah. And that was so smart of him to push Popo away from Nana. He pushed Nana off yeah. the stage knowing that she would die from that without a save. And right. so he's like, let me get Popo in the opposite direction as far as possible. Yeah, it's like playing teams, right? You just right. gotta knock one away, especially with how dumb Nana is. Right. <laughs> <laughs> she's not She's not the best teammate. She's stupid. <laughs> oh! And? Oh. Not quite getting that, though. That's huge. Oh, man. Missing and the shakeout so quick from Johnny. Yeah, missing these handoffs are actually costing Army quite a bit. Right. Oh, <laughs> S2J with the cute fade back knee. Yeah, he can just take up space, right? The way he was like fade back knee in the in the corner. Like, what is Army gonna do? Right. He doesn't want to. Yeah, he could run it if he went in. He might get hit by that knee as well. So, Dang, S2J is... doing a really good job, just kind of putting on a clinic for the matchup. This yeah. is how you're supposed to play Falcon versus Ices. Minus oh. that up smash. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. Oh man, oh, doing the gentleman getting... right after. Look at the little mix-up. He goes right for Nana, and then. Yeah. Man, this oh, is man. this is so decisive. Brutal. And yeah, I love so S2J went for that hit on both climbers a minute ago and didn't oh, connect God. either, but he still L canceled it. Right. Which is actually so tricky to do. Yeah, the timing is messed up. Yeah, it's gonna depend on whether you hit them or not usually when you L cancel, but S2J is still ready for it somehow. Yo, Johnny is bodying him. 
It's it's brutal right now. This is this is ugly. Oh, oh my god! Oh. Soft knee to hard knee, and it is four stocks to one on, on his counter your pick. counter pick. On Army's counter pick. On Icy's strongest stage. <sighs> Looking rough so far. Oh, and he doesn't oh. get the edge guard either. Oh boy. Okay, that should be yeah. The wobble finally coming out. But it's such a high percent. S two J doesn't give a damn about it. He's like whatever. Yeah. <laughs> you can get you can get two more of those and he's still good. Yeah, that's why you see him di hard away because he's like yeah. Oh. Yep. The mash out. So fast. S two J, one of the fastest players in the business. Yeah. Okay. Great grab from Army. Oh. Good God. roll out. Oh. Wait, wait a minute. A could he stop? Oh, oh. He anticipated the fade back, but S two J actually barely landing on stage. And he's gonna kill Nana. Oh, oh goes yeah. for the hard save, which he kind of so had to do. I, three I, stocks to one. You need wobble. I on your think side. in that situation, that was actually the play. It didn't work out, obviously. And even if he, it had saved, there's a good chance SCJ would have then killed Nana. But you kind of have to go for that as the ice climbers in that scenario. Right back to Effie. Dang. Army shaking his head a little bit, knowing he can do a little bit better than that at least. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh that's a good way to start. That's an excellent way to start. Yeah, so a nice little mix up there because everyone's usually expecting the down throw down air. He went for the up smash. S2J kind of smashed the eyeing up. Right. Just led right into another grab and then the wobble. The times that Army does do well in this matchup, or any matchup in particular, where he, where he gets those um, anti air up airs or anti air uh, up smashes, right? Because mm -hmm. they net everything. Right. You can, you can get everything. Especially against the Johnny. And against Falcon, it can go. It can be so potent, like those. But at the same time, Johnny's Ooh. mixing up his timing so. Okay. Oh, S Wheel of Fortune. <laughs> He'd like to buy a valve. Oh, oh man. Oh. That's the valley bot. Oh. I. <laughs> Eight. Eight. Oh, oh, oh he wow. drops and it. Yeah, that was strange from Army. Maybe didn't think he would have had the full wobble confirm. So try to go for something else, but it looked like he had it. Yeah. Oh, nice. Hitting him out of the side B. Very solid. Okay. Oh, wow. Love that. The hammer to hammer. They're working in tandem. Can't touch this. Okay. Nice. Army doing a lot better this game. But. And the good save. Ooh, ooh, yo. That is one of the best saves you can do is when your opponent is off stage like that because they don't have the option to then punish Nana afterwards. Mm -hmm. Oh, nice. And okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah, just the refresh. Yeah, smart from SVJ oh. to wait for it, but that time he knows he can't do it forever, right? At yeah. some point he's got to make some kind of move. So SVJ sniffing that out. Yeah, he got him at the one time where you could punish him. Mm -hmm. Oh, and that's going to be a softy double D. Yep. And back to even. Even though this has been by far Army's best game so far, it's just even. Yeah. I think the ledge play actually cost him a little bit. Um, mm -hmm. Having that nano, that previous stock would have. Yeah, I think he did it just a, a couple too many times because mm -hmm. the, the opponent can catch on eventually. She is invincible for most of that. Right, right. But a green. Right. Okay, oh. SUJ actually missing there. But just the spacing, even when yeah. he whiffs the move completely, yeah. he's still not leaving himself open. Yeah, and I think that's the real hallmark of this matchup, right? Mm -hmm. Doing those kind of stomps and those knees with the slight uh, the slight delay mm -hmm. to oh, where man. the ICs can't punish you. Right. Or it, it gets right in between your shield and pushes them apart. It's so good. Yeah. Johnny. This, I mean, as much as army is an amazing player there's a reason why suj was heavily favored here and why we were kind of talking about it like like he was going to win because yeah he plays the matchup so well oh man he doesn't even get the jab reset to another wobble because mm -hmm. army has to rely on super hard reads to get the opening right whereas falcon can kind of do like these safe ish aerials right that aren't too committal and if he yeah. does hit he can net so much off of it so yeah that's what really makes it. Yeah, as long as he gets the L cancel, which S2J has shown that he's capable of doing, whether or not the move actually connects or with. <laughs> but Army does even it back to last stock, and he does have Nana. Oh, oh and Nana with the grab. Oh no, dash attack. Oh, dash attack. Uh oh, he's got it. Oh, and jab reset. That's a wobble. Oh, there oh, it is. And Nicely Army. done. Whew. And a tricky little, that's almost like a self-mix. I don't think Army even necessarily knew where Nana was going to throw him, but he <laughs> followed up properly and got the wobble, and that's the game. That's the true mix-up. That's the only way you can mix up Johnny, you not knowing what's <laughs> you, happening either. <laughs> if you know what's happening, Johnny knows, so <laughs> you just got to try not to know. Dang. Johnny. 
but yeah, still Johnny's it's... still looking really strong but army finally on the board yeah and uh he's gonna have to contend with two back-to-back -back s2j counter picks but there's not really a super strong counter pick for falcon in the matchup right like as we discussed before it's not a huge deal either way no nah, yeah i mean just having the platforms is gonna allow uh, him to dance especially on the top platform it's kind of difficult for ICs to really contend with that right so it just gives them a little bit more options and ICs aren't the most mobile in those situations. Mm -hmm. But yeah, it's not terrible. Certainly not bad at all. Oh, what a grab. Good tech away. Um, if he had teched in, I think Army would have got the jab reset into a grab. Just that immediate follow from Johnny, as usual. Yeah. Okay, Johnny missing his initial dash there. Could have potentially been a down throw knee, but... Ooh, what a confirm. Yeah, just instantaneous. Yeah. Again, one of the fastest players in the game. I think oh, it just gets caught right there. Wobbles. As the set progresses, Army has a really good understanding of where you're going to be, and you're going to see those kind of raw grabs way yeah. more in neutral. That's, I think that's one thing about fighting Army or really any player that has a lot of good wobble setups is the longer the set goes on, the more susceptible you are to being wobbled because they're catching on to your patterns yeah. and where you're going to be in the neutral in general. So they can find those openings a little better. Mm -hmm. So you you want to get it over with as fast as possible. If you're SCJ, you do not want to see a game five here. No, you really don't. And it's kind of looking... Oh, nice. Oh, great smash the eye to get out of that. He keeps the jab going. At that point, you kind of have to. Oh, oh, he gets yeah. oh wait a minute. Oh, Army. Handoff. Army. Wait a second. Could be S2J's first loss to Ice Climbers in quite some time if Army keeps this up. Yeah. But he's still got two more games to go. Okay. Oh, that's big. Ooh. Yeah, and S2J doing a great <gasps> job of kind of keeping them separated. Bad spot. Doesn't take too much for it. Yeah, I think he's kind of going a little bit more than he would in the other games, right? You saw like a lot of delays in the timing from SDG. He's kind of doing it now in this neutral. Right. But the first couple stocks, I think he was just going ham a little bit because the game seemed so in his favor, right? right? And I think players like Army will thrive on that kind of energy. Yeah, that's exactly what they want is for you to get kind of comfortable. Mm -hmm. Oh, good mash out again. Yeah, so fast. So necessary. <laughs> he, he really needs that, yeah. <gasps> oh, gets on the other side of him. Oh, he doesn't oh, get the jab reset. Oh, wow, and just barely spaces outside of that. Oh, that's big. Mana should be good. Oh, oh and that great was up air. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Nice fast move mm -hmm. while keeping yourself pretty safe. Yeah. Yeah, you're yeah. not. You don't feel too threatened here. Oh, the oh. double roll. <laughs> yeah, these rolls not looking too hot from S2J, but oh man, going back to ledge in that position—that's oh, wow. the one way that Icy's can KO you, right? So you go back to ledge and you get down smashed. So risky, but it worked out. Yeah. <gasps> oh, I take it all back, Army. Sopo work from Army. This po. This just the po. One po. Okay. Shout out to Dunk. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh the single hit in there, but he's keeping it. I think he could have just gone uh, down throw knee. Yeah. Or down throw up air at the very least. Yeah, up air definitely would have worked and pushed him off stage. Good so. edge cancel. Uh oh, Ooh, a little bit too low for that upbeat to get to the edge. S2J trying to close this out. Should be an edge guard. Yeah. yeah, oh man, this is kind of dicey now. Yeah, this is scary on both sides. Having the invincibility is so good, though. You, you just ate like 50% off the Nana. Oh, Great save. Amazing save to but still get. But Nana, Nana's at like 80%. Yeah, he's still going to save her because he kind of needs to. He and she's to. living for now. But off stage again. Okay, Nana alive. Nice gentleman. Oh, doesn't get quite the timing. Yeah. The slow get up from Nana because she was over 100, but there it is. The knee's going to close it out. Johnny. S2J, even though Army made some great adjustments throughout that set, and you kind of saw it happening live where he was catching on to S2J's neutral. Right. S2J is just that good at the matchup that it didn't end up mattering Absolutely. in the long run. Yeah, especially with uh, Johnny tightening it up the way that he was in the pri uh, prior games, like games one and two, right. where he would just like do that kind of delay, hit you right in the center of your shield keep going with that kind of pressure because as we talked about there's not too much risk in it if you are l canceling it as you mentioned you know yeah. whereas army had to go for hard reads had to go for these like crazy tech j situations yeah had to do a lot with his po which yeah. he did in uh, <laughs> some of those games and yeah he made the po work for sure especially uh that second stock second to last stock in that last game but still didn't matter in the long run again s2j just so good at the matchup 
Falcon definitely favored in the matchup. Oh, absolutely. And that's going to set up S2J versus Fiction. Fiction. Ooh. The winner's finals. Oh, that my goodness. That is an interesting one. Arguably the top two players in SoCal right now that actually go to tournaments. Shout out to Mango. I see. And also, <laughs> yeah, Cody would be up there, too, just because he's new. Right. Uh, and then SPAT would be around there, too. So Yeah. yeah. But as far as just, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, performance yeah. in the local scene, it seems like S2J and Fiction are, are up there with the best of them right now. For They'd sure. Out here. They're the winner's finals. But That's before be that, crazy set. we got yeah. losers' quarters oh, set Ty up West here. Walls. Yeah, Ty Westwalls. You can't count out Ty in any of these matchups. He's been so he's consistent over the years, right? Like, right around that top 40 level right, for, like, the last, like, six years, yeah, I feel like. Yeah, slowly but surely improving, yeah. right? Like, he hasn't jumped rank a ton, but he's gone up, like, maybe 10 ranks a year on average. Or something. Yeah. Like, he's, he's definitely been pushing the whole time, and getting more and more consistent. He's a grinder, too. Every oh, time right. I see him outside of tournament, he's just playing all the friendlies that he can. Right. And you love to see it. And he's also just so stylish, one of the more stylish marts, I feel. Especially yeah. with these T-drops on FOD, right. some of his uh, combo games. Yeah. Pretty cool. And, of course, West Balls, you all know him. You love him. What is there to say to West Balls that hasn't already been said about West Balls? <laughs> <laughs> I was wondering where you're going with that. I, didn't, I, didn't, I was hoping I came up with something on the way. But I, I